Hi, Ayana. I hope you're doing great. I hope you are all doing so good. Um, so I am going to read um, a book for you. So one of the things I want you to do while I read the book is listen. Um, I'm going to stop and I'm going to ask you a few questions. You can um, write the questions down or you can think of them in your head, but I want you to tell somebody your answers. Um, your mom, your dad, um, somebody, okay? So I want you to really think about um, my questions when I'm answering or while I'm reading the book, okay? So what book we're going to read is called Potato Pants. <clears throat> and this book is by Lori Keller. And Lori Keller is the author. What is an author? So take a stop, pause the video, write it down or tell somebody what is an author of a book. And then I want you to think if you found out the answer to an author, what is an illustrator? What do they do within the book? What are their jobs? Okay, so let's start reading our book. Potato is excited. That's why he's doing the robot. I call it the Pobot because I'm a potato. He's excited because today, for one day only, Lance Vance's Fancy Pants Store is selling potato pants. Eee! This is Paige. You can see him doing the robot. Potato knows every tater in town will want a pair, so he's there early because like the sign says, once they're gone, they're gone. Let's see all the taters running for Lance Vance's Fancy Pants store. I want a stripy pair, just like the ones in the window with stripy suspenders for added stripiness. And the sign in the window says, potato pants, today only. Once they're gone, they're gone. <clears throat> What's this? Potato is upset. That's why he stopped doing the robot. He's upset about that eggplant who just walked into Lance Vance's fancy pants store. Why is he doing here? Eggplants don't even wear pants. Yesterday was Eggplant Pants Day. Uh oh. All right, Ayana, what I want you to do now is I want you to make a prediction. A prediction is a guess. What are we going to do next? What do you think is going to happen in the story next? So again, you can either write it down or you can tell your mom, your dad, tell somebody. What do you think is going to happen next in this story? Okay, so take a pause and try to think of that, okay? Okay, we're going to keep reading. Potato won't go into Lance Vance's Fancy Pants store now because of that eggplant. That eggplant is nothing but trouble. Yesterday, I was walking along, minding my own business, my own potato -y business. Out of nowhere, he pushes me and says, out of my way. When he ran by and pushed me right into the trash can. If he sees me in Lance Vance's pants, fancy pants store, he'll push me again. And run and ruin a brand new potato pants. Oh. Poor potato. It's not easy for him to watch all the other potatoes walk by in their new potato pants. I love my potato pants. We love ours too. Mine have polka dots and ruffles. Mine have big pockets. Mine are kind of scratchy. I may need new. I may need some potato underpants. Potato is losing his patience, waiting for that eggplant to leave Lance Vance's Lance Vance's fancy pants store. What's taking him so long? 
And if yesterday was eggplant pants day, why is he here on potato pants day? Potato pants, that's ridiculous. Potatoes don't even wear pants. It's not ridiculous, grocery store lady. Oh, the grocery store. They have potatoes. Maybe, ooh, maybe they'll have potato pants. Mm. Okay, so what do we think? Do you think the grocery store is going to have potato pants? I don't know. So let's find out. You know, pants that are made for potatoes. Well, maybe in your store you call them something more like spud slacks or tater trousers, yam chaps. Any of those ring a bell? Heck, I could probably squeeze myself into a pair of cucumber cords if I had to. Do you have any cucumber cords? Sorry, sir, uh, no clothing here, just food. <clears throat> All right, so did they end up finding potato pants at the grocery store, Ayana? I don't know. I don't think they did. Let's see. Let's see if they end up finding some some other place. Potato is not giving up. He's sure there's a way to get potato pants without having to face that eggplant. Think, think, think. Don't panic. I still have time. Actually, you don't have much time. There's only one pair of potato pants left on the rack. Only one pair of potato pants left on the rack? Oh, what will a potato do now? So let's actually think. Do we think that Potato Pants is going to get his potato pants? I don't know. Let's see. Potato Pants! Out of my way! Only one pair left! What a brave potato. He's not going to let that eggplant stop him from getting his last pair of potato pants on the rack. Bam! Potato pants! Where are they? I need potato pants. Yikes. Potato may be in for some trouble than he bargained for after that entrance. So let's look back. It says, Potato may be in for more trouble than he bargained for. What does the word bargain mean? What does it mean that he would be in trouble? What was his entrance like? I want you to try and answer those three questions for me. Okay? So the word bargain means that he is giving something. 